Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you, okay? So let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aquarius, it looks like you get something good coming in for you. And there's somebody trying to be slippery, slick, sly, a sneak, and try to sneak their way back into your life, okay? You may have kind of gotten out under their rule, their reign, their delusion that they fed you. You you got away from it. Um, you were able to slip away from this, okay? Um, they could be coming back. Um, trying to come back romantic. This is poor timing, though. Somebody still haven't learned lessons, still haven't grown up, still haven't hasn't matured. Um, someone just wants you back because with you, there is good energy. There could also be someone sensing that you're about to get some big reward, the big payback. OK, um, you've done some work and it's about to pay off for you or you put the work in the game or whatever type of game work you do. You know, um, you could be the entertainment industry and somebody is trying to come back to you a deceitful treacherous person okay they're gonna use they're gonna be cunning it could be uh, so they're gonna be acting in their feminine energy okay even if they're a man they're going to try to use wit charm charm and disarm you to get you to come back so that it can be a part of this this right here the big payback when that check comes to you and it says pay to the order of uh aquarius um, they want to be a part of that and it can even be like energy, you know, like maybe they have money. Maybe they don't need, they don't need your money. They don't want your money. But they want to be a part of that energy. This could be like a clout chase, a clout chaser or someone's chasing fame. They want to be a part of your fame, your acclaim, your claim to fame. Let's see what's going on here. And, and they're still not in an energy where they're settled. They're still all over the damn place. You know, and they're, they can't be trusted to, they don't have loyalty. They have loyalty to themselves, okay? Yeah, the devil card is still in some type of toxic, low vibrational, devil type of energy. A chain. So you got from under their, their rule and they want you back on the chain, okay? They got other people and other things on their chains too, honey. It ain't just you, but they want you back on the chain. With you, it might have been different you know like you bring an, an energy of good luck big payback you bring an energy of money you know you bring a different energy and they want it want it back it could be a capricorn trying to weasel back into your life okay it could be someone that you need to learn a lesson why you met them and maybe you've already learned a lesson and you're trying to move on and they haven't therefore they can't move on yeah this is somebody it could be libra libra rising for you could have that um for you four of swords this is somebody who felt like, okay, the, the time apart that we took apart, me and Aquarius, it was temporary. I was always coming back. Yeah, this is the big comeback. But they're a weasel, okay? Um, this is, They know that this relationship between the two of you is real testy. It's, it's like thin ice. Like anything they say or do will be held against them in the court of Aquarius. And they also feel like... um. You know, uh, this is make it or break it time. So they coming back like a weasel. You know, weasel, they they don't say anything, do anything, right? They're coming back trying to be very romantic. Uh, what else do we have for Aquarius here? Seven of Swords, wow. They're coming back with strategy, trickery, mastery, okay? How can I trick the Aquarius? How can I uh, make it seem as if this is acting, actor, masquerading? How can I act as if I want a relationship when I really want to go it alone when I really want to be a loner when I really will leave them holding the bag maybe the bag of tears I'll leave them crying again well, how can I get them to trust me because the seven of swords is about let me you know gaining maybe trust through deceit trickery lies a weasel this could even be friends okay clout chasers because the seven of swords talks about loss of friendship so maybe you you cut some friends off they're trying to come back because you're about to get the big payback Aquarius Let's see what the advice is for you, Aquarius. All right, what is the advice for Aquarius? Advice for Aquarius. Forgiveness. All right, so forgive these people, okay? 
um, still act in the energy of forgiveness and forgive yourself first. Forgiveness happens with you and then you start to work outward. So forgive yourself. Like, oh, I was so stupid and I was so... Forgive yourself and then move. start moving outward, right? Let's see. Forgiveness. And then we have no with an exclamation point. So if that question is, should I take them back? Should I be their friend again? The cards say no with an exclamation point. All right, let's see. Recovery. I can't make it up, Aquarius. All that was lost. All that you had to sacrifice, you will recover. Some of you are on the beginning, in the beginning of recovery. Some of you on the tail end where it's about to come for you, the big payback. And these people can sense it and they want to be a part of it. I can't make it up within the next few months. And there's no need to worry, Aquarius. You are protected, okay? No need to worry about these people. No need to worry about your circumstances. Just follow this reading, this very short reading. Forgiveness starts with self and then forgive others. You're about to go into recovery, okay? Healing of all sorts. And just know that it's a no. And boom, your life will change. All right, that's what I have for you, Aquarius. If you want to get your own personal reading like this one, go over to the website. Uh, we have the 10 minute phone Zoom readings on sale for $25. I'll link it below. Um, and then you can also catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, 9 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where I do collective readings that I answer your questions. Okay. And then uh, if you took something from the reading, you could buy me a coffee. I do like coffee. Come on. The link is below. It says buy Ella Coffee. Um, and uh, if you would like to, Join the KTMG Keep the Momentum Going monthly conference call. Go ahead and do so where you get all things business, practical and spiritual. And you're around like minded individuals um, just like you. Or if you would like to hop on a complimentary discovery call with me to see if I could help you in your business endeavors. Go ahead and do so. The links will be below. Thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. We were meant to create sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually mentally emotionally or even physically and this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations if you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction then you're in the right place as a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality.